I'm going to be opening up this pack, which guarantees us a Dark Matter. That's right. It's the craziest pack we've had all year. And it could give us the likes of Dark Matter Jimmy Butler, Dark Matter Derek Rose, Dark Matter Nick Young, Dark Matter Larry Bird, Dark Matter Sean Kemp, and finally Dark Matter Chris Stapps. But that's not all. You can see there, it actually says Eclipse Plus. And that's because you've also got a chance at being able to pull 100 overall Giannis. And man, that would be the craziest thing ever. So you may be wondering, how do you get this pack? Well, you can see right here, the way you get it is by locking in every single one of the Eclipse players. So there's three Galaxy Opals and then three Pink Diamonds. If you were to go through and buy every single one of these players, because fortunately you can actually get all of them from the player market, it would cost about 450,000. An MT. In good news though, I was able to pull all of them. And in even better news, I've got a bunch of Eclipse packs right here to open up, including some base packs, some normal packs, and some deluxe packs. So let's start with the base packs. The way I was able to get these base packs is just through the exchange and also the spotlight challenges. So we end up getting just an emerald in this, that's fine. As yes, when I get a duplicate unsellable amethyst, I always just put it in the exchange to see what we're able to get because potentially it could be a great pack. These ones weren't though. But now we've got two normal Eclipse packs and these ones usually cost 21,000 MT and we could have a chance at pulling a dark matter in this. You never know, that's the thing. So no shaking either. And that's just a goal. Stanley Amude. Amud. I don't know. Okay, surely this next pack has to be better. We didn't look, we didn't put everything in the exchange for no reason, and we do get a shake. That's good to see. And bam, it's a pink diamond. So that makes it worth it because now that means if this isn't a duplicate, we will be able to sell it. And it's power forward. It's going to be Brian Scalabrini, which again is a W because I have his other card unauctionable. No, actually auctionable. I got my words mixed up. So that means now when we go, yep, we got this card. That's great to see. It means I can come here, I can swap them out, and I can... Oh, I actually did have him unauctionable. Whoops. Well, actually, that means I can just put him into the exchange as an Eclipse player, and there we go. Now, we've almost got ourselves another Deluxe pack because we've already got two of them, and these guarantee a Pink Diamond or higher, and I've seen some people pull some great things out of these. So, let's see how good they are. Let's see how good they are for me. Our first Eclipse Deluxe pack gives us a Pink Diamond in the middle. Okay, well, that's not exciting at all. I don't even like seeing it in the middle just because you know instantly what you're able to get. This is a Rui Hachimura. I don't think I have this card unsellable as in my collection right now. So that gives us a bit of MT. Was I right? Was I right? Let's swap it. 21K, I'll take it. Given I got these packs for pretty much free, it is a W. And now for our final deluxe pack, can we get something good? A shake to the left. It's not a dark matter, but it is a pink diamond. Okay, well... I guess it's fine. I guess it's fine. There's like one player I haven't got, and this is Rui Hachimura once again. Okay, well, I guess I'm going to put him into the exchange for that final pink diamond play that we need to put in to be able to give us another deluxe pack. That's a big L, but I guess it means we just get another deluxe pack, and hopefully this one's going to be better. So we add to the exchange. We go like this. Thank you very much. Giving ourselves another deluxe pack, and maybe now when we open this up, it's going to be even better. So Eclipse Deluxe Pack, two pink diamonds so far, a normal shake to the right. This one is another pink diamond, making it three in a row. Can this one at least not be a dupe? Okay, Eastern Conference shooting guard. That's Harold Miner. I do have him unsellable as well. Wait, I think that means I have every card unsellable. So it really didn't matter. I don't know what I'm saying. I can now only put him in this exchange. I guess we'll do it because I'm not selling him for 2K. So I'm not going to lie. All those packs were an L, but fortunately we've already got all the players to be able to lock in for the guaranteed dark matter pack. And I think it's time to do it. I think it's time to hit triangle. I think it's time to lock in for this pack. Let's do it and let's get the animation of saying yes we've got our pack and you can see there it's dark matter plus meaning we could get a 100 overall now this is how it's going to go the card i want most is Giannis. then second most i want jimmy butler and third most i want nick young i don't want d rose i don't want larry i don't want sean kemp and i don't want chris Stapps because i already have all of the cards i would love 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 this jimmy butler though and obviously Giannis. so come on it's our time to shine we've got our eclipse plus pack and i'm gonna need your guys help be sure to smash that like button down below to give me some better luck to see if we can get something crazy because imagine if this is a 100 overall i don't know i'll go absolutely insane but i think it's time now that we actually flip it it's time to open it our eclipse plus pack can we get the animation for a 100 overall or is it just going to be a dark matter 
it is a dark matter. It's crazy to say now the fact that yes, it's just a dark matter, whatever. That's expected from this pack, but the dark matter animation is great to see, but I just don't want a duplicate. I want Jimmy Bucket so bad. So we need to see Eastern Conference small forward. Then we'll instantly know it's Jimmy Butler. And if we see Shooting Guard, we'll know it's Swaggy P. They're the ones I want to see. So come on, please give me something good 2K, please. Please give me what I want and let's get it. Let's flip it and see which player it's going to be. Eclipse plus pack center. No, I mean, look. This is interesting. This is very interesting because I'm not going to lie. This is probably a W. Oh, this is so weird. This is actually so weird. The crazy part is this is by far the best one you can pull if I didn't already have it. But yes, the sad part is we do already have him. But the good part is, is this one's unsellable. And that means now when I swap my player to my collection, you can see we have this holographic version of him because I got the craziest pull the other day and he's got a nine grading on him. Meaning this card sells for 463,000 MT. And given all the holo does is add yes coolness factor but makes himself for so much MT I wish I could keep the hollow to flex but I think I'm actually going to sell him I think I'm going to sell him for the amount of MT and just keep the unsellable one so I think we got to do it let's do it just like that we have so much more MT that's such a weird thing like I'm so happy but I'm also sad in a way because it's like I wanted Jimmy I also wanted Nick Young I'm so happy I didn't get D-Rose so happy I didn't get Larry and even happier I didn't get Sean Kemp but given I have an unauctionable Chris Dapps now I can't lie it's actually pretty cool because now you can see we have him in the team and this team just looks absolutely insane so i think it's time we test out the team but i'm also interested in what you guys got be sure to let me know if you did lock in this set for the eclipse plus pack what dark matter did you get let me know in the comment section as i feel like a lot of people are going to be jealous i actually got this chris Tapps. but hey the squad's looking crazy we've got dark matter d rose dark matter sean kemp dark matter larry and obviously dark matter chris Tapps. we've already got our weekend ring but i want to get another w so anyway without further ado let's get into the game okay this is a pretty nice team and we're actually going against the pink diamond chris Tapp, so that's going to be interesting especially because obviously we've got the dark matter as he pauses straight away let's go on tiktok in the meantime oh we're back we're back i was just watching you know just some good tiktok so you gotta love that anyway let's play this good defense this time and let's see what this chris Tapp's pausing is and also all of these other cards can do for us so chris Tapp's this time back out to you maybe that's a shot i have to take i don't even know but Chris Dapps, back out to you this time on Marcus Soul. Yeah, that card's actually really good. For a free locker code, shout out to 2K for giving that one out. That's a steal. Chris Dapps, get that one. Okay, well, it's actually Kobe who pulls it up. And is that... That's his ball. Really? The question is, do I like badge up my Chris Dapps now that I know I'm not going to sell him for ages because we have an unsellable, amazing center dash power forward? And how did he get that dunk on me? I actually have no idea, but... Chris Tapps this time, I'm expecting a big play from you. And it's going to be on this pick and fade. He's going to be one of the best pick and faders in the game for sure. And we had to shoot that shot. We had to shoot that shot. I wanted to pass that one earlier too. For some reason, my buttons just aren't really working. You know when that happens. But this time we can get a pick and fade. That's a good screen too. He stays with it. We kick it out to him. He jumps at me. It's fine. Chris Tapps all the way. Let's slam it on him. Yo, what's up, my man? Oh my God. Yeah, so just like that, my opponent is a fan and you gotta love it. We hit that shot. Oh, that should be a steal, bro. But I shouldn't say a fan. I should say a subscriber because he was so nice. So we love to hear it. And also we love to get these steals with Larry Bird. I told him he was gonna be in the video too. So let's see what this Chris Snaps can do as he gets us the block, then also the rebound. And now maybe an assist, pass fake. Yep, we love it. Kobe, finish that off, get that assist. Fine, we get the steal. We get the steal. Now let's give it to our boy. Now let's give it down here. Now let's get the slam. I like it. Bro, my opponent is a good player. Shout out to him. Maybe we just got to try and attempt to score with other players because scoring just with Chris Dapps maybe isn't the best idea, but he is such a beast and one too. What's his free throw? I actually have no idea. Okay, it's a bit slow, but it's good. You know what? I think we have to just go for another three here and that's the exact option that we missed. <sighs> Real question, how in the world do I miss that shot in that situation? Like, I can't even talk about it just because that is an awful miss with that good of a card. At least we get a steal straight after. We give it back to Shea. Shea runs it on the inside. Shea pulls a three and we're not missing with Shea. The good thing is, is we are absolutely showing up this pink diamond Chris Dapps and that's a great strip there. So let's give this one to maybe Shea or maybe Larry. Shea, it is for another three. Back to back, it's green. This should be a rebound. This should be a rebound and it is. It's rebound number two. Should we give this one Shea? Again. That's a great steal. Bro, that is an awful pass by me. We need to get a stop here. We need to jump at this. That's still good recovery defense by the boys, especially in transition. And we need to just keep it up this time. 
absolutely perfect. Like, we cannot say we are playing bad defense here. That is perfect, D. He still gets the three. Like, that's what I'm saying. He's a great player, the dude I'm going against right now. So I fully respect it. And now, Chris Stapps this time. Let's see what you can do for me. Back up Shea Gildas Alexander. This card is way too good. I think I'm doing my thing where I go for way too many steals. So let's get that two. Get that board. That's rebound number three. We gotta love to see it. Now let's give it to Shea this time. Oh my word. He is way too good. Come on, Larry. You have to at least show something for me here. You're a dark matter card. You better not get beat. And that's good defense this time. It's actually perfect defense on this card here. Let's get out to it with Larry. Larry, stay in front. Larry, stay up and he misses. Okay, how did we get that rebound? Maybe Larry Bird is a beast. So let's give this one to Kobe. Kobe, finish off the three just like so. I think it's actually the lateral quickness of this Chris Stapps, which is kind of throwing me off. But let's get our first points with Larry. I like it. And look at the amount of takeovers we actually have. It's so nice to see because Shea has it. Chris Stapps has it. Also, our boy Kobe Bryant has it. So it's absolutely beautiful. And you know what, Shea Gildas Alexander? Another three. Why not? The SGA and Chris Stapps duo is absolutely popping off this game. Let's get a steal. Let's get a steal. Oh, no. He made that pass. He made another pass, but we get the stop. And maybe that just right there is what we needed to put us up by double digits. That's what I'm going for here. And that's what we want. So Chris Dapps, you know, you want to do it for me. Two players with takeover. He knows that I actually will shoot with this SGA now, which is probably a good thing you're up for us. So Chris Dapps, let's get that done. And I haven't made any substitutions. The reason I haven't though, is just because my players have been getting takeover so quickly and so easily that I don't want to take them off when they've got takeover, especially this Chris Dapps because he's slamming on everyone. Okay, Polo Bancaro versus this man right here. Okay, that's still good defense. That is still great defense. Marcus Sol this time, the free card, and oh my word. Oh my word. What good defense is all I got to say. Let's stop. Let's pop. Chris Tapps this time gets it to go. Another board. I love it. That's rebound number four. And who are we looking at here? It is Mr. Kobe Bryant. Oh, that's good. Whoa, whoa, whoa. There is no way he actually made that play. Okay, well, let's keep our hands up. And then he gets a wide open three. What a play. Sometimes you just got to give props where props are due. And that's that exact scenario right there. Right there. Um, Let's pump fake that. Let's not take that. Let's kick it out. And let's make sure we make the right play. SGA this time. Making a perfect play. Getting us some separation. Going inside and going to the line. Yeah, we got lucky there. And his free throw. I forgot how slow it was. Okay, I got to remember how it's kind of slow. Then we met... We actually missed. That's an 8% chance of missing that. The chances of us missing both free throws is so low, but we actually did. I've just brought on all my Dark Matters though. All my new Dark Matters from the Eclipse Packs are on the floor right now, including this Derek Rose, who we take an absolutely awful shot with to start. We've still got Larry Bird on the floor too, but this might not be working out well. As he gets another three, Chris Stapps pulls it down though. Chris Stapps saves the day. Now let's give it to Sean Kemp. Sean this time, pull that three and let's green it too. Fun fact too, I have played a few games with this Derek Rose and I actually really like this card. So we'll have to see how he goes in this game. And uh, Chris Stapps in the corner. I like it. You know what I don't like about it though? It's the fact that we're in his Chris Stapps and we still score. Boards, that's number six. We're actually on triple double watch here. And let's look at this dime. To Larry Bird, let's finish it off. I truly do just need to make sure we keep this lead though. Because as I said, my opponent's a good player. Derek Rose this time though. Take it all the way and let's get that done. Maybe Larry Bird at power forward is the option because he's playing some good defense here. Staying in front and that's perfect all the way that time. Chris Stapps is definitely tired. He's going against Wemby, but that's not even a mismatch at all because we've actually got the mismatch ourselves. That's a great shot. That is a great shot for that three. I couldn't get over that screen. That screen just killed me. And now we need to make sure we get a good dunk with this D Rose. That's all I want in this possession. Derek Rose just pushes Austin Reeves, goes, get out of my way. And then makes that. What? It's exactly what I'm talking about. My opponent's such a good player. We're only up by nine points now. And Derek Rose, yep, he's struggling, but that had to be a three. If we didn't get bumped there, that was the three. And let's give it to Larry. Larry, bird, four, maybe a shot or just pull it out. Just pull it out. Just chill. Get a pick and fade. Run to the left. Derek Rose this time. Let's finish another and one just like that. Thank you very much, Derek Rose. We're not missing the free throw. I like it. Okay, what about another slam with Derek Rose? He's got such a big dunk beater. Oh, what? How did we even get that steal? I actually don't even know. We've got, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, well, don't worry. I don't even know what I'm doing on this possession. Just give it to Sean Kemp though. He'll dunk it. Oh, that's should be a steal to Chris Stapps. Then let's stop, pop, pull that three, bang. I guess this video is seriously showing how good that Marcus Hole is for absolutely free. Sean Kemp this time, I'm actually real. I was going to say, I really like this card, really like his release. And then we end up missing the shot just like that. And instead he comes down and ends up making a three. That one was 75% contested. Are you kidding me? It's fine though. We've seen two more boards and two more assists for a triple double. Let's make this three. Oh, no, 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 no. This isn't happening. This is not happening. We need to, there's no, don't. 
He made it. I definitely need to focus up here. It's now only a five point ball game. A five point ball game. He has absolutely come back. Let's make it seven with Brandon Miller. Yeah, look, maybe I should bring my bench on, but we are learning. We're learning how to play with these boys. We're learning what to do. And Larry Bird, you're the man for the moment. You are the man for the moment to make the right plays, kick it out to our boy Chris Dapps and get fouled going to the line. Man, that was lucky. We just have to make sure we make these free throws as this is for 30 points right here, which we love to see. And you know what? Let's make it 31. We love it. Anyway, we ended up winning by eight points. And man, that was a great game. Because hey, Chris Dapps in 20 minutes had 31 points, nine rebounds, eight assists, four steals, one block, only two turnovers and shot extremely well too. Then obviously Shea was insane, but all the other dark matters did contribute. So I really can't be mad with how anyone played. Meaning now we get to drop the ball and we actually have a really good drop as we've got Pink Diamond Rayful friends on it. So let's drop it right here. See if we can get it in the blue. I find that middle blue spot so hard to get. And I don't think we're going to get it here either. We get the red. Yeah, look, that ain't too good. But yes, yeah, so all in all, I'm happy I got this Chris Dapps because it made me so much MT. I can't lie though. I wish I was able to get this Jimmy. But watch real quick. This is how you get him. You just end up opening up a pack just like this. Then you go into the pack and you go, thank you very much for Jimmy Butler. Here we go. Eclipse pack, Dark Matter. No, um, we get an Amethyst. All right, well... There you go. This is what I then do with the Amethyst though. We put it in the Eclipse base pack where it's obviously super rare to get anything good, but you never know. And that's why I just always put those Amethysts in it. So we get what? Another? No, we get a Ruby. Yeah, not great. I'm not going to lie. But hey, obviously the team is looking insane as being able to add an unsellable Chris Dapps. Yeah, is definitely a W. So anyway, I appreciate you guys watching this video. Be sure to smash that like button, subscribe if you're new, follow me on TikTok, Twitter, and Instagram. And I guess that's pretty much it. Thank you guys for watching and I'll catch you in the next video. Bye.